Some of us are biased to be an optimist. Some of us are biased to be a pessimist. Uh, some of us are biased uh, to, to say it's a conspiracy. Some of us are biased to say this and that. And uh, it, it's very interesting to watch yourself and notice, well, what is it that you, when you see this, what emotions come up for you? What do you do? Because even though some of us think what we're doing is the right way, uh, it, not, none of it actually helps decision making and the behavior that should go forward. And I'll give you a bit of a story. In, in 2008, I had uh, a share in a, in a bar in a restaurant. And uh, I was a DJ at the time. And when 2008 hit, I, I was an optimist. Everything's going to be fine. I said, I'm not laying off any staff. Everything's going to be great. Like we're going to win. And I just ignored reality. And that bias really ended. I was like, I just kept putting more money in. I kept doing things. And in the end, I was wrong. Uh, I lost, I lost my business and we had to let go of all the staff that I didn't want to let go in the beginning. And if I just let them go in the beginning, they would have been okay. Um, and we would have just got to the same result faster without me having to put all my life savings into the business and, and really get in a bad, a bad uh, state. Does that make sense, everyone? Does that make sense? Like my bias, it, it wasn't, it was just how I was wired. Uh, I'm wired that way. And so right now, we have to understand that however you're wired, that's what's going to, to show up for you. But that wiring, that coding isn't actually based on reality. Okay. It's not actually reality. It's just how you're wired. So we need to get ourselves into a place where we're not emotional and we're not taking the past and putting it onto the future so we can see what's here and make decisions.